and like there is a lot of air how he moves but he still like makes small mistakes in the in the rhythm there so what I wanted to do is like <laughs> do a shoulder in and then flex him into a round back so you let him look to the good and then you make the neck straight and then you uh, do a shoulder in again so as soon as you feel that you lose that sort of energy in the front leg it's probably because he is not carrying himself well enough on both legs. good and then careful flexing to the left good <coughs> and then careful flexing to the right good and what also happens there Melissa when you do the shoulder in you use a lot of right leg no left leg so Still, you have to ride the front leg in with your left leg. It's like one leg cannot push both forward and sideways. So the legs are, and, and that helps her a bit good. And uh, now start with the round bar. Round bar is when, when the hind leg is on the track and the front leg is inside the track and the horse is looking in the direction of the Good. So, and then carefully, but then just like feel the mouth. Do I have the same contact in both frames when you uh, flex him to the right? Good. Same contact. And when, when he gets stronger on one, then you counter flex him again. direction of movement. Good. And then make him straight, let the hind leg go back to the track. Good. And then again into the inside. So so that you can determine how much do you want the hind leg to get go in. The outside leg here is yielding the horse with the hind leg to the side. But the but the right leg still should push him forward because when you feel that the horse isn't going if you only use more outside leg, you only ask the horse to put the hind leg more to the side and it's more difficult for him to move. So by, by straightening up the hind leg to the track and then just pushing a little bit to the side, you will make it easier for the horse to really go forward. Good, and then, good, and then make it straight again. Good, and then, uh, good, so that you don't do too much. Good, so it's almost too much. Good. Okay, and now stay on the circle one round, you can walk with her. And then you look at me next time, and then you come on a diagonal from K, stay on the circle. And now you think that in the same way that you had the uh, fence on your left side. So his front legs is coming towards me. I want her to take the hind leg to the side because otherwise most people only ride the half passes pushing the horse to the side, not deciding where the front leg is going. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Oh, very good. <clears throat> and then you can say, okay, and then you trot up and then you do the same and now I will stay here. So when, when the judge is looking at the horse from the front, the horse has to bend more so that he stays like parallel to the long side. So, because this is a shorter line, this is already for Grand Prix, so it's, I just want to see how he does it. Now do it from the right brain again. So now even if you couldn't keep him quite parallel with the long side, you still keep the front leg towards me. And if you feel that he loses the the trot, then you make him a bit more straight. Very good. Very good. Very good. Okay, and walk. Good. Okay, and walk. And then you come both here. 